the clasped hands symbolize faith or friendship, the heart symbolizes love, and the crown symbolizes loyalty. And so if we were indoors, the two separate candles would come together like this candle, we would be able to extinguish the candles on our own time, and such is not always given. <laughs> indeed, indeed. So, as we pass through the lives of others and they through ours, we experience the unbroken circle of family and friends, those who are here, those who are not. As a token of such wisdom, John and Anita have two gifts to give. Anita, a gift to say, John, a gift to rock. to carry forward a mountain, sharing the beauty of a mountain sunset with Anita. Another aside, the only mandate, as I told you, that John gave me was to see that the exchange of vows takes place at 810 as the sun is setting. Imagine. Uh, I'm sure it is. John and Anita still climb mountains and dive deep. They also know how to pause and enjoy the setting sun from the top of the mountain. And so for you, John, I've chosen the design of a mountain with a sun behind. A sun which may be setting, may be rising, or both. <laughs> a final poem by Nicholas Gordon. Thank you for your friendship. Thank you for your friendship and your love, however life may turn. This gift will be a mountain 
that has made my river bend, nor will it flow the same way to the sea. Knowing you is something I am made of. Years will not part of me remove. One lives for just a brief eternity, understanding truths that never end. Live well, love well. Ellen, the music. <laughs> Confederation. <laughs> 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 